So you look at the planet we're on now, how many species of humans can we look at from different countries? Are we calling people from another country aliens because they look like aliens or because they're just from another part of the planet? Uh, same way, we have visitors from other planets coming to this planet for thousands of years. Uh, that's a given. We're going to leave this material world anyway. When you leave your body, you're transferring yourself to another body or another place. So, uh, in a way, we are all implanted into this planet called Earth, and it's our duty to find our way back home, because as spirit souls, we don't belong in the material world. We're all aliens to this world, because we don't belong here. We belong in a spiritual environment. So, in a sense, we're all implanted into this material world. And the thing is, uh, again, are you going to identify yourself as, as a particular species of life? Like, I'm a human, therefore I could kill any other creatures that are not like me as a human? Or are we going to look at every living entity, every life form, as a spirit soul, that I'm a spirit soul, that's a spirit soul? That's your choice. If you want to look at life as a materialistic object, that I am this body, and that's not a body like mine, therefore I'm going to kill it and eat it, or therefore I'm going to keep it from living on my planet the way I'm living. Uh, that's pretty uh, dogmatic and secular too. So we got to have an open mind, open heart. That I'm a spirit soul. That cat's a spirit soul. The cow's a spirit soul. The pig's a spirit soul. And that human over there from another country is also a spirit soul. Once we get on the same page with that, I think we all li live as a big happy family again. But as long as we're identifying ourselves as I'm this American, you're an Iraqi. Or I'm my religion, I'm a Christian, you're a Separation. Muslim, or I'm my skin color, I'm white, you're black. As long as we keep this mental activity going on, I'm this physical body, then we'll be always in illusion. We'll never really understand the absolute truth. So the point is, I'm just trying to get, there's all these species of life, and they've always been here, and there is a supreme personality who puts it all into play, just to make it all interesting for us. If it was all the same, if we all had the same skin color, and we all had the same big eyes, and the skinny legs and arms uh, flying around in UFOs, I think that would be a very boring life. So, because we got all this variety and different species to interact with, there you go. You got something interesting. So thank God we're not all extraterrestrials exactly. flying around in UFOs.